Simple Gift Series is proudly made possible by Visit Colorado Springs, Colorado, Olympic City, USA, and the Colorado Springs Airport, Colorado's small airport. Tis a gift to be simple, tis a gift to be free. Everybody, it's always so good to see you. Did you hear the instrument that was playing with us? A piano. A piano. That's right. It's a piano. I love a piano. Do you have a piano where you live? There are several different kinds of piano. Some look like this, and they're called grand pianos. Others look like this, and they're called upright pianos because they stand upright. There are also different kinds of electric pianos. That means that they need electricity to make sounds. Some are bigger, and some are easier to take with you. On the front of the piano is the keyboard. It has 88 keys. That's a lot, isn't it? When you push on a key, it plays a note. The farther we play to our left, the lower the note. And the farther we play to our right, the higher the note. You can play one note at a time, or you can play a bunch of notes together. There are two different kinds of keys on the keyboard. Some are black, and some are white, and they're all important when we want to play music. The white keys are all in one big row. 
the black keys are in little groups of two, then three, then two, then three, all the way up the keyboard. When you play a piano, you decide which notes you want to play, and you push those keys. But the secret to how a piano makes sound is on the inside. Let's take a look. Miss Linda, would you mind if we opened your piano so we can all look inside? Of course, Marty. It's pretty cool. But make sure you keep your fingers out of the way just in case. The lid is very heavy. Oh, I will. Can you see that, everybody? It's full of strings. They are pulled very, very tight. Yep. <laughs> Every key on the keyboard is connected to a soft little hammer on the inside of the piano. And when we push a key, that little hammer taps the string. That's right. That makes the string vibrate and make a noise. Each string is tuned to be a different note, just like how you tune a ukulele or any other instrument with strings. And we all know how important it is to tune our instruments. Miss Linda, will you show everybody where middle C is? Sure, Marty. Middle C is right in the middle of the entire keyboard. It's the white key right here in front of these two black keys. When we sit down at the piano bench, it's where our hands meet. That's great! Miss Linda, will you sing the piano song with me? I would love to sing the piano song. Oh, how I love my piano, my music-making friend. When I start to play my piano, I never want it to end. This is middle C, the middle of the keys. When I take a seat, it's where my two hands meet. Oh, how I love my piano, my music-making friend. When I start to play my piano, I never want it to end. Two black keys, three black keys, Two black keys, three black keys, two black keys, three black keys. If you play piano, you need all of these. Oh, how I love my piano, my music-making friend. When I start to play my piano, I never wanted to end. When we sing a scale, it's do, re, mi. Now to write it down, it's simple as A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Then A, B, C. Oh, how I love my piano, my music-making friend. When I start to play my piano, I never want it to end. What's
Welcome to my Curiosity Corner. I'm Miss Lynette and I have a wonderful adventure that I would love to share with you. Let's take a look. Hi boys and girls, guess where I am today? I'm at the Colorado Springs Utilities Conservation and Environmental Center with my special friend Dewey. Dewey is a drop of water, and he's traveled over 100 miles to see you today. That's a very long way. Dewey helps to make sure all of us have clean water to be healthy and safe. Have you ever been curious or wondered how clean water gets to your house? How did Dewey get into that glass of water you drink? Or in the bath with you? Let's think about where you live and how we need Dewey each and every day around the house. Let's have Dewey show us. Look where Dewey is. He's at the sink. I want you to think about what you do at your sink or faucet. Wash your hands brush your teeth, get a glass of water, so many things. Where's Dewey now? Oh yes, we need water to cook with. Looks like Dewey would love some mac and cheese. How about you? And the dishwasher to clean our dishes. Hey Dewey, where are you going? He's on the washing machine. That's right, we couldn't have clean clothes without water. And what about a clean body? And Dewey doesn't want us to forget that we need water to use the bathroom. sure is busy in our homes. We use water all the time. We couldn't live without it. Let's go up high into the mountains where Dewey first starts as a little tiny snowflake. Most of our water that we drink is melted snow. It's like catching a snowflake on your tongue and drinking it up. Well, when Dewey melts on the mountaintops, he rushes down a stream, through tunnels into a pipe, then to a pump station and to a reservoir where he is stored. Dewey then goes to the treatment plant to get tested to be sure he's nice and clean. And then he comes to your house where you have clean water. Here are some things Dewey wants us to remember. Turn off the faucet as you brush your teeth. Don't let the water run while you are cleaning the dinner plates. Always wash a full load of laundry not just a few clothes. I sure am thirsty after all that. I'm going to have a nice glass of water from my faucet that is clean and safe to drink. I sure have learned so much from Dewey today. I bet you have too. I'm going to be very careful and think about how important water is to all of us and make sure not to waste a drop. Thank you, Dewey, for teaching us so much. See you next time. Stay curious and keep wondering.
every way, way, way. Water, 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 how you flow, flow, flow. Water, 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 what we know, know, know. We need you, need you, need you every day, day, day. In every, 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 every way, way, way. Water, 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 how you flow, flow, flow. Water, 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 what we know, know, know. We need you, need you, need you every day, day, day. In every, 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 every way, way, way. Hi boys and girls. I just thought of a game that we haven't played in the yard yet. The rhyming game. I love this one. You know, like what rhymes with you? New, two, you get it? Let's sing. Come along with me and you will see that once you fun. It's simple as can be. Like one, two, three. It's a game I like to play each and every day. Are you ready? Here we go. What rhymes with cat? Bat, hat, mat. Good job. What rhymes with bed? Head, bread, red. <laughs> What rhymes with flow? No, go, bow. What rhymes with big? Dig, fig, twig. One more. What rhymes with see? Once you've begun, rhyming is fun. It's simple as can be, like one, two, three. It's a game I like to play each and every day. That was fun. Fun rhymes with done. And now our song is done. What time it is now? Yep, <laughs> it's story time, story time, time to read our book. It's story time, story time, time to take a look. Look who it is now. It's our friend Betty the Bookworm. How are you today, Betty? I've had a lovely day, thank you. We just learned a lot about water. Don't we have a story about water? Oh, that's right. It's called Water, Wonderful Water. That's the one. Let's read together. Water, Wonderful Water. Songs and Book, written by Linda Weiss. Illustrated by Christina Wells. Water, oh, wonderful water. You cover most of our globe. Water, wonderful water. You are Mother Earth's blue robe. Water, wonderful water. Home to creatures large and small. Water, wonderful water. You are important us all. Water, 
wonderful water, oceans, seas, rivers, and lakes. Water, wonderful water, we'll take care of you no matter what it takes. Water, wonderful water, the plants need you to grow. Water, wonderful water, you are stronger than we know. Water, wonderful water, you do so many things. Water, wonderful water, you are a rain shower in the spring. Water, wonderful water, you wash the dishes in my sink. Water, wonderful water, we have you in a glass to drink. Water, wonderful water, you make a fun belly flop. Water, wonderful water, want to waste a drop. Water, wonderful water, when it's cold, you are snow and ice. Water, wonderful water, when you're warm, a tea is nice. Water, wonderful water, you're a very precious friend. Water, wonderful water, on you we all depend. Water, wonderful water, we need you to survive. Water, wonderful water, you keep us all alive. I love that story about water, Betty. Thank you. Now, let's sing our water song together. Water, wonderful water, we need you every day. Water, wonderful water, in every sort of I wonder if someone left us something. Let's go and see. I wonder what gift we got today. Let's look together. What a beautiful bow. Are you ready? It's water, and what a precious gift water is. It keeps us all alive. We have to be careful with how we use it because we all need it. 
So we must share and make sure there's enough for everyone. Remember to reflect on all of the simple gifts we get each and every day and to pause and be grateful for everyone. We had so much fun together, didn't we boys and girls? We learned how a piano works with Marty. We learned about water's journey from way up in the mountains all the way into our homes. Water is wonderful, isn't it? Thanks for learning about it with me. We'll see each other again soon and learn some more. For now, so long for now, my friends. This time now must end. It's been so much fun, but we're not done because I'll see you soon again. My dear, dear friends, see you soon. For more information about this series, visit us at www.simplegiftseries.com. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram at Simple Gift Series.